Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. If you don't know me, my name is Ashley and welcome to another vlog. Now this vlog is gonna start any second now. This is me coming in from the future. Just to say, I lost a bunch of footage for this vlog. So some of it is gonna be narrated by the lovely Leash. I will tag her channel below in the description, but I hope you enjoy this vlog and let's go to Scotland. Okay, so when you walk straight in, you have like this huge double bed with these lovely little bedside lamps. I really like the cute little touches they have in this hotel. And then come straight over here into the bathroom. But um, so we have a full length shower and toilet. So as you come in, you've got the wardrobe section here, you've got Leash sitting, pretending that she's a candid person <laughs> on the sofa. And then we have a TV screen dinner table and here is our little kitchenette area which is actually fully equipped to the flipping oven this was 90 pounds for the night which i think is a really good deal this is the cheapest room they have available um so i think we're gonna get settled in and go and have a look around edinburgh so we're just walking to meet keelan for drinks and i just think it's kind of cute how everywhere in scotland there's a castle what oh wait i'll show you <laughs> Like just casually walking down the road and boom, castle with a moat thing. What? <laughs> okay, so quick change, and we are now walking to go and meet our friend Keelan, who is so funny because we've been speaking to her online for like over a year. It's gotta be over a year, right? IG friends. IG friends. We're IG friends. Really. Yeah, literally. Um, so we're gonna go and meet her now at the hotel that she's staying at. Um, she kind of lives between Scotland and Ireland, um, so she knows this place like the back of her hand. She's lived in Edinburgh for a while, so we're gonna go and meet her, have some drinks, maybe have a couple of nibbles, and yeah, excited to spend our evening in Edinburgh. It's a really nice evening, actually. So yeah, excited. It's nice, but we still got puff jackets <laughs> Alright, we've got our masks on, but we're here. Really so, we're heading up for drinks. I'm really excited to see you. Oh, look at this, I like a fucking mask. What's going on here? So we have just picked up the rental car from Budget. We booked it literally this morning. It's all been a bit of like fly by the seat of your pants situation. Um, but I'm so happy with what we've got because last time we went on our road trip, we had like this dad mobile, which was not a bit of us. Whereas I think this is going to be good fun. It's like a little mini SUV. I feel like beautiful <laughs> hey guys so we've been driving most of the day not most of the day a couple of hours um to get into like kind of like the highlands area of scotland because we are coming to visit um we're gonna go to like, this cottage area called glendive i digress we'll get to that later but on the way we want to stop at this beautiful castle it feels like scotland is a bit of a fairy tale like so i'm gonna show you the castle right now it's pink guys Okay, so on the Richter scale of ratings for the castle, I'm actually gonna give it like a nine because it's hella princessy. I mean, it'd probably be cuter if you could go in, but obviously due to COVID, it's closed. But if you're just coming for some Instagrammable moments, I definitely think this is up there on the, on the Scotland list. So, but yeah, anyway, we're gonna head back down to Glendie now and you see our lovely cabin. I'm so excited. No bother. So guys, we have just reached 
reached our destination. Um, we are staying in a cottage in a beautiful little area called, well, actually, sorry, the area is not called Glendai. The premises is called the Glendai. So it's um, an array of like cottages and cabins, um, and, like little, little cabins all over. And then we have actually a four bedroom premises with a double bedroom and a single bedroom upstairs and a dub two double bedrooms downstairs, but four bed, no, three beds in total, double and two singles, and a bathroom. So we've got a massive amount of space. Let me show you now. So there was downstairs bedroom, one and downstairs bedroom two. We had lots of space, literally. So we have a fully equipped kitchen, little fridge, which we have slightly stocked. Um, all the things you could need. So we have a coffee machine and they kindly provided us with these coffee beans, which you grind up yourself. And then you can put it in the coffee machine. It makes you fresh coffee. We've got a toaster, a kettle for my Americans who don't use kettles, we've got a proper kettle. Um, we've got an induction stove here. Um, and then we also have a washing machine and dishwasher. We have our dining space with a stunning Scottish view. Um, I'm really feeling all the artworks around the place. Um, all the art is super gorge, really eclectic vibes, loving it. Then we come through to our living space where we have a wood fire. Can you imagine? So gorge. They also supply you with unlimited firewood, which I think is a bonus. We then also had a really cute outdoor space where we kept the firewood and where you can sit and enjoy meals when it's nice and warm. It was not warm. Um, and then we had two upstairs bedrooms, which look like this. So it's all very cute. So one of the features I really love about the upstairs bedroom is it has this nightlight which you can open up completely and stick your head out the window. And then you have a view of next door's garden. I'm not gonna show you that because they're actually there. And then we have like this lovely forest here. As you can see, there's a gate where you're allowed to go and walk into the all these grounds are part of it. And then down there is our living room and our eating space. And actually across here is the sauna, the games room and our hot tub. So guys, it is 10.07, what a long day. Probably doesn't feel like a long day for you because you've been watching for two minutes, but we are just sitting down for dinner. So we've made some salmon in the oven with some potatoes and spinach because we're on a health kick. Um, so not like overly indulging, but like really nice fresh dinner. And it was so easy and nice because they thought about everything here. I just there's so many details they've really thought about. Um, we're just in love of cottage Scottish love. In my city guys so we have gotten up this morning in our lovely cottage and unfortunately it's absolutely chucking it down with rain outside um we're hoping it starts to slow down it's actually gotten heavier um okay this is the outside right now well you can hardly even see through the rainy window okay, through, the through the glass because it's so foggy but i think we're gonna go and try and get some eggs there's a hutch next to the building office and you basically go get your eggs from there for your breakfast so we're gonna venture outside So we're gonna venture out into the wilderness. I have this cute kind of fall outfit on. I'm gonna show you guys. So my jumper, a shirt, and a completed skirt. But I've actually had to put on some bottoms as well because of the rain. And if I take any pics, I'll just have to like bust them off. But um, we're gonna go on a venture. not hot <laughs> it's about 90 minutes so we're still trying to get it to hot enough to get in we thought we would take advantage of this time and go for a walk around the grounds because it's not raining and it just seems super beautiful out here i'm gonna show you as much as i can um but 
I, I think I'm fully converted to the like nature life. It took us about two and a half hours to get the water hot enough to get into the hot tub. So it's like almost nine o'clock actually. <laughs> so it's like a very, very evening. It's, it's still pretty bright out, um, funny enough. For May, I just did this, I have hair. Um, for May, like it's pretty bright out. So we're gonna take some pics. Let me show you the hot tub. <laughs> literally flaming hot right now in this hot tub. Not joking. <laughs> but I'm definitely putting that in the vlog. <laughs> but yeah, I'm in the bath, as you guys can see. We've heated up our hot tub and I have to say, absolutely loving the vibes, guys. It's so nice, it's so steamy. You, feel, you do not feel cold whatsoever. Like, I feel literally boiling. It's lovely. And I took some pictures, let me show you. Hope oh, somebody gonna solve them And so I lose myself in labor Good morning guys, so it is our last morning England night and we're actually pretty sad about it We could definitely stay for another day We are just having some breakfast now So it's a very odd concoction because it's a mixture of all the things that are left over I've got some beetroot as well And I've got some green tea and coffee So we basically just need to finish everything we have because when we go back to the city we're staying in a hotel um, and we won't have a kitchen space this time so we're just gonna get some brekkie in leash what would you rate your stay here out of 10 10 out of 10 really 100 percent. like we've been saying it the whole time they have not missed a trick here at all like whenever you think you need something they've got it They've thought well, I, I remember, I've realized one thing they didn't provide that I think they should have. What? They didn't provide any to um, like toiletries. Oh, yeah. And because we're in an area where it's really hard to get anything, it okay. would be really, really beneficial to have a mini toothpaste or some shower gel or some shampoo. Yeah. Luckily, we, like, I had conditioner, so we just both conditioned our hair. But, um, don't worry, we had soap. Yeah. But... It would be nice to have those things provided um, just because it's really hard to get hold of them anywhere and it's not like we can just pop to the shop. So that is the one thing I think they missed. But absolutely everything else, they had it. They had it. So what are we saying? 9.5 out of 10 or 10? I'm going to give it a 9.5. I think I'm still going to say 10. All right, what about 9.75 actually? 9.8. Okay, cool. <laughs> we'll, go with, we'll go with 9.8. 